This tutorial covers example 1 from the SP column manual. A link to the manual can be found below the video. In example 1, I will use a square column and calculate the load moment capacities for several load conditions. The first step will be to prepare the input. From the input menu, choose general information. Fill out the labels. The project is example 1. The column is PCA notes. The engineer will be SP. For the design code, we'll use ACI 318-14. For the units, we'll use English. For the run option, we'll choose investigation. For run axis, we'll use about the X axis. And we will not be considering slenderness. Choose OK. Next, I will begin assigning properties. From the input menu, choose material properties and we're going to use the default settings for concrete strength we want 4 KSI and for reinforcing steel we want 60 KSI choose OK alright back to the input menu choose section rectangular and we want a 16 inch by 16 inch rectangular section and we'll choose OK Next we'll do reinforcement, go to the input menu, reinforcement, all sides equal. For the number of bars we want 4, for the bar size we want number 8, for the clear cover we want 1.5 inches, for the bar layout we want rectangular, and we're going to cover two transverse bars. Choose OK. Alright, next go back to the input menu, choose loads control points and now we're ready to solve so go to solve execute and now we get our interaction diagram and for more detailed results we can go to view results and SP results module will display more detailed results for us and if we want to print our results we can go to view reporter and the SP reporter will create a report for our results and we have options as to the type of report and what information is included in it. Thank you for watching and check out our other tutorial videos. Links are below the video.